Today, National Candy Corn Day. Woohoo! Either you love the seasonal sweet treat or you hate it. Just don't underestimate it because it has been around longer than any of us. More than 100 years ago, the first candy corn was made. So how did it become a seasonal staple with staying power? Let's connect the dots. The company now known as Jelly Belly produced the very first candy corn around the year 1900. It took a long process and a lot of manpower to create the sugar, corn syrup, and marshmallow concoction. But it first went by the less appetizing name, Chicken Feed, and was a year-round treat. It didn't become a Halloween staple until the 1950s. Sugar rations from World War II were lifted, and kids started a tradition of going door-to-door -door collecting candy. Today, candy corn is made by machines, but with the same basic ingredients, proving it's a recipe that stands the test of time and taste buds. And that is Connecting the Dots. So how many things can you say were around in the year 1900 and taste exactly the same? Not very many. Would we, you don't like know, one? we don't know if they taste exactly the same. Well, they say it's the same basic ingredients. It's the same yeah. recipe. Is, candy, is that a trademark name? So it is a company that's called Candy Corn? Mm -hmm. mm. Jelly Bean started it, okay. but this is not a Jelly Bean product, so this might be an imposter. I actually don't think uh, they have a taste. It's not trademarked. Okay. Well, we can all like make our own candy corn. That's right. Yeah, seriously. Mm. Ruby doesn't think they taste like anything. Oh, they <laughs> taste sweet. They taste like sugar. Yeah, it's like pure sugar, but a lot of people like it. I love them. Mm. Yeah. All right. Let us know. Love candy corn. Loathe them.